This is Moto Vlog number 22. We are on our favorite route. It is a beautiful day in Tennessee. Just got off work, changed clothes, and hopped on the Dyna because there's a couple things I wanted to talk about today. So uh, it's almost been a year of me being on YouTube. So I've been reflecting back on some things I learned, and I want to start there. Uh, four things I've learned about being on YouTube for a year so I think the first one that's glaring since I got my new computer is that <laughs> so much fun Whew, I missed the dyno from being on the bagger last week but yeah the first thing is your computer um, you really need a decent computer to do this um, a lot of the video editing software takes a lot of a lot of strength to run processors graphics card etc so if you're starting a YouTube channel if you're starting a, a vlog a motor vlog whatever um, you gotta have a decent computer first and foremost when I started I basically knew nothing about that side of the world and kind of learned everything as I went. Um, tried to improve every video. As you can probably tell the progression, I actually have every video that I've ever posted on YouTube is listed. Some guys take off, you know, little videos that weren't edited and stuff like that. There's, If you look all the way in the bottom of my videos, there is every single video that that I've ever uploaded to YouTube is is down there at the bottom. So that will segue into number two. Number two is actually video editing software. Um, you want to get some good stuff. I started out basic, like like everyone else would, I guess. Um, started with the GoPro app, the Quick Desktop app, and that's fairly decent stuff for you know just playing some music on the video no microphones no talking no editing it's it's just cut and pick you a song type stuff very basic so after that i moved to uh, vsdc which i use the majority of the time it's a free software service it's a free software service that you can get and uh, I think there's a pro version 20 bucks more a month and it helps renders the videos faster I never really noticed the difference but uh, yeah it's out there VSTC is, is a really good uh, free software service ever since I switched to Adobe Premiere Pro man I've, I've been wanting to learn that stuff so so much and uh, been using it for two videos now and it is super super cool there's a lot of stuff I mean they they you know edit movies with this stuff so it's, it's really neat uh, can't can't wait to get start getting better at that my last video I'll put it up Road Glide project part number two I'll put that up there at the top here somewhere and uh yeah you can tell the little tricks in there I'm slowly starting to learn that stuff it's it's super easy to 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 use once you figure out what's going on so yeah that's it uh computer number one software number two and the next thing that that I learned was you know you want to be pretty consistent you want to post a video at least once a week I, I, I would get kind of antsy and see other people doing videos and want to do video and do twice a week but you know this year I think this is gonna be my six, 61st video so um, I've kind of one one a week two a week type of thing you don't want to overload it and you want your t your videos to have time to, to get views you don't want to push a lot of good videos down I that actually happened to me I got some followers on Instagram later so a lot of those early videos didn't get looked at but uh, yeah yeah that's that's number three number 
Yeah, number three is just be consistent. Be very consistent with what you're doing. Uh, post a video once a week. Picking a day and time is all up to you and all that good stuff. So, uh, Number four that I learned, which was really awesome, I did not expect this because I figured that other moto vloggers were going to be competitive with each other because of, I guess, the nature. You know, some people look at it as, oh, this could be a business, a part-time job, that type of stuff. And if you don't look at it that way, like myself, I just want to... just wanted to learn video editing and make some cool videos and this is a really cool road and there's no traffic but yeah I never really thought of it as a business opportunity um, maybe I don't know a little bit you know but I didn't think right away you know but but yeah I, I thoroughly enjoyed a to edit videos like i've said before man it's it's fun to create something you're basically creating something out of out of a raw product of a raw gopro footage so uh it's it, it's cool to see the end product and all that stuff and to learn i mean you know there there is people that make money just editing editing video you know so there's that but yeah, the, the Motovlog community, man, it's it's it wasn't what I expected, and everybody's awesome. They support each other uh, through and through with questions, answers, and stuff like that. How you do this, theories, you know. There's it's 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 amazing. I did not expect the uh, the community to be so awesome. So, but yeah, those are four, five, yeah, four four things that. I learned uh, this this year on uh, YouTube was that uh, you can you can start out not knowing anything and move on from there and have a you have a YouTube channel. This thing's so fun down that dead end road right there any houses so yeah guys that's going to be it for friday's video here uh i would like to thank purpose built motorcycles for all the love and check me out on instagram if you haven't checked me out on instagram it's at trip underscore hp junkie and use discount code trip hp i'll put it here on the screen maybe Trip HP at Purpose Built site for a discount code. For a discount code. For a discount uh, on any of their stuff. They make parts, gear, super cool guys, affordable working man pricing. And if you like this video, if you want to comment on some things that you as a motor vlogger have learned on YouTube let me know in the comments below and i'm super excited i got some news uh this week that there may be another moto vlogger coming into town maybe a couple maybe three maybe four who knows but yes there may be a uh kind of a dual vlog setup uh with another channel another popular harley channel here in nashville coming up recently uh that's that's all i can say about it right now uh also have front patriot springs that within the next couple days we're going to shoot a video on that and give a pretty detailed how-to on how to put springs or rebuild the front end on your dyna so be looking out for that and i just wanted to thank everyone for the support again man you guys are awesome the community is awesome i feel the love thank you for watching my videos we just passed 25,000 views and I did it in a year and without you guys it wouldn't be possible so as always guys like comment and subscribe let me know how i'm doing and take it easy. We'll see you on the next one.